shot off it It ain't safe from it But she's still gonna hold on It ain't safe from it But she does it right from right here Lies, guns, drugs, violence So besties, while we're big, I just want to share something with you guys real quick. I just want to bless you guys while we big. I want you guys to, you know, listen very attentively. Um, sometime last, I think last month or so, a girl messaged me and was like she was interested in joining my bible study because i had posted about it and she was like she was interested in joining my bible study that happens every friday you know weekly and then uh i was really excited and i was like welcome welcome we talked about it and i asked her what like what church she attends and what their doctrine was like and then she went like um she dropped out of church i was like i don't understand what do you mean you dropped out of church like in her words i dropped out of church i was like okay what happened what do you mean she was like she stops going to church her problems are really overwhelming and she doesn't see the need because you know she has been in church and she's still stuck and then i was like if i understand you clearly you left church you stopped going to church because you feel like your prayers are not being you know answered by god and she said yes okay now i'm going to show you guys exactly what i shared with her that changed her mind and i'm going to be using examples from the bible do you all know that when you are going through problems in life god is going through them with you if you ask him to because psalm 23 says sorry about that guys psalm 23 says though i walk through the valley of the shadow of death i fear no evil do you know why i fear no evil it's because god is walking through with me the Bible said, though I walk through the valley, though I walk through the valley. So God knows that you are already going to walk through valley, but he's going to be there with you. So if you are going through problems and you're saying that you, are, you don't want to walk with God anymore, then you're on your own. Jesus said, you are now on your own. Now let's take a look at Daniel in the Bible. When Daniel was being thrown into the lion's den, God did not stop the people from throwing him into the lion's den. What happened? He came and he came, he came into that problem with Daniel. Do you understand? And he shot the lion's man. He was in that problem with Daniel. He did not stop Daniel from falling into the lion's den, but he came and was with Daniel about shadrach meshach and abednego did he stop them from throwing those hebrew boys into the fire he didn't he didn't stop them from throwing those hebrew boys into the fairy furnace he didn't but what did he do he stepped into the problem with them he stepped into the problem with them so god may necessarily not stop you from going through problems what does he do he steps he makes the problem easy for you he steps into the problem with you so if you're in a problem and you feel like okay what you should do is to you know stop calling on god because god doesn't seem to hear you you are doing yourself wrong you're harming yourself if you are going through a problem this is the best time to call upon god this is the best time to still keep trusting in god i already um shared a message about Sergeant michelle and abednego before my pre previous um vlog to see the kind of faith that they had that god was going to come through for them so whatever problem you are going through in life just have it in mind that all you need is god it's not a time to forsake god and say god my problems are bigger than you it's a time to even lean on god the more it's a time to lean on God more because the Bible says, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil because God is always with me. 
so yeah i hope you guys are blessed by that and let's keep watching whenever i'm wearing my khaki so i'm going to work today apparently they started giving out um acceptance letters they started yesterday but i didn't want to go yesterday so yeah i'm going there now and hopefully 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 this time around i am giving it's quite rainy it's rained heavily this morning but it's still drizzling now so yeah i'll let you guys know if they give me or i still waste the time today sometimes i wonder how people beat traffic do you understand it could never be me like i don't know it's just not it's just not in me to do things out of order like i'm a person i'm a sucker for orderliness like do you understand i'm a sucker for doing things the way things are supposed to be done so i can't i can't even beat traffic it's, it's that serious <laughs> oh god i don't know how people do it but i don't know I can't say it's okay because it's not. It's honestly not. But they will be fine. We will all be fine. Hey guys. I'm here. Not here yet, sir. But I have to keep my phone. You know how this soldiers can be. Bye. guys i'm so excited i'm finally done finally resuming work on monday oh. apparently i don't know what's going on between this kk and that um car you're seeing but this is the time i am coming back home from cds my very first cds it's so crazy and guys do you know the funny part the funny part is the fact that the funny part is the fact that i did not even turn print like it's turn printing week and i did not turn print like i have to go back there tomorrow morning it's so crazy eh? god okay let me focus looks good why did you take me to the freezer yeah. it looks good the color 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 hope it's not salty you guys you can make me rise i'm just coming back from work now and i know i'd not leave food in the house like you know i not bring out um, food from freezer to warm but uh, mm -hmm. fresh food though yeah. okay. mm -hmm. so guys i just received my package from lagos and i'm about to open it now so guys i don't know why this perfume came in this package just a single perfume and it was just you know packaged like this see there's literally nothing in this box and i had to pay how much twelve thousand naira to get this you know delivered oh crazy yeah. but i'm not going to unbox it yet not now later in the day yeah why is this drizzling on my first day at work? Huh? Hi guys, so these are some of the packages that I received this week. I don't know, I've not opened most of them, but I've opened this one. This is um my baby's when I saw this I was like blue box, blue box. And then I opened it and I saw this. Although I have not used it yet. Ta-da! It's so cute. It's so cute. 
Tita. Oh my. Mommy, come and see your box. Love it. Love. What is home? Tell mommy thank you. Uh huh. Have some sparkle. Wow, it's so nice. It's so lovely. So um, I'm told that this is it. This is it. I'm told that you have to preheat it before using. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. So, yep, it's so cute. I like it. I really, really do like it. Yep, yep, yeah. Eva, do you like it? Yes. You like it? Say yes. Yes. And then okay. Yes, I'm so you don't need, don't worry. And I got this. I'll let you guys know why I got this in a in a few days time on my next vlog. Yeah. Or oh, my next two vlogs. I don't know. I don't know. But I'll let you guys know why I got this. So guys, hi. These are the things that I got. I got um chicken feet. If you know me very well, you know that I love, love, love chicken feet. So I got chicken feet and I got I got chicken throat this is, and I also got chicken throat this is chicken throat I, these are the weird things that I love I love chicken throat this is um this is a full chicken I think this is ouch this is a full chicken that was just cut in bits and then I got chicken I got chicken wings this is chicken wings and I got gizzard as well cookies out this is basically ouch everything that i got from my chicken vendor today and i don't know what i'm going to be using this for but i think it's going to be for my birthday it's okay hey guys so i was just craving catfish and then i realized that i had some in the freezer so So for my favorite soup, you guys, in here I have my curry, my ginger, garlic, granite pepper, suya pepper, thyme, salt, maggi cubes, and um, pepper soup spice, as well as fresh pepper. I think what else do I have in here? I don't know. Before. That's basically it for now. And yes, yes, that's it. So you guys, for your favorite soup, and we are making it in. Always add little water to boil when you're boiling first before adding the whole water that your soup is going to need. Do you understand? Just like you boil your meat, just boil it a little bit first. Then later you can now add the whole water that your soup is going to need and then season again.
Good night. Okay, let's see what we have here. Um, oh my gosh, this is so cute. So guys, I got this package from Rain Luxury. She's having her grand opening of her Abuja store Sunday 23rd June 2024 and the time is 12 p.m. Here's the address. Guys, I am particularly very happy about this one because I've wanted her to be in Abuja for such a very long time. She says the most affordable and quality items ever. So please, if you're in Abuja and you can, next week Sunday, please do come out. There will be a lot to eat, drink, merry, and of course, a lot to buy. So please, I am going to be there and I cannot wait to see you guys. And thank you, Maureen, for this um, invite. I really do appreciate it. Thank you you guys i came to the mall to get some stuff and i don't know all banks are down and i cannot even transfer money it's crazy so and i i have already picked everything that i am buying i just left it at the counter and i it with me we were really sweaty because apparently there's no light so i had to like come back inside the car to try send the money or because i've called my husband i've called my sister none of them seem to have networks i'm just here waiting it out while i collect cool ac because inside the mall is so hot you guys that's the updates man so guys, it's Salah day and I am currently on my way to my friend's house. She's invited me over for Salah and that's where I'm heading to eat some goat meat, some ram meat rather, and just have fun. So bye guys. At their house, just tell me why. They sure know how, they know how to party, these people. <laughs> Good. You can say hi your hair you need to go and cut it off like once you get to the estate now you cut your hair get back home you cut your hair Hi. abby yes because you say you don't want to make your hair right yes mm -hmm. <laughs> so, <laughs> <water can enter. laughs> guys we also bought um souvenirs she gave us some fresh round meat i don't know why some christians don't eat don't eat um ram meat but that's okay and then she gave us some rice and then some sia so yeah these are the things that we got as souvenir it's always so nice this is in a mirror for salad I don't know whether it's small or big salad So yeah, let me go and keep my souvenir. Thank you for watching this vlog. I love you guys. Bye.